All about inspections. An inspection is an evaluation of a home's condition. It's a valuable part of the home buying process because it allows you, the home buyer, to make sure there are no hidden costs and repairs you'll have to make when you move in. Let's answer the five W's about home inspections. Home inspections typically take place seven to 14 days after the purchase offer has been accepted. The contract usually includes a condition called a home inspection contingency. That means the contract will only move forward when the inspection is complete and both parties agree on necessary repairs. Inspections typically take one to three hours depending on the size of the home. When scheduling an inspection, let the property owner know that you'll be there and make sure the utilities will be turned on at that time, especially in foreclosed homes. Make sure that places like basements, attics, and service panels are accessible as well. And most importantly, schedule the inspection during a time that you can be there. Who? Don't wait until signing a contract to find a trusted inspector. You may not have time to find one. Not all states require inspectors to be licensed, so ask your real estate agent for recommendations since he or she has experience working with trusted inspectors. Some mortgage lenders require pest or mold inspections too, so ask the inspection company what services they can provide, and ask your agent for recommendations for these special types of inspections. The home buyer is expected to pay the cost of the inspection up front. A typical inspection costs about $300 to $500, though that can increase based on the size and location of the home. Where? So, where does an inspector inspect? First of all, he or she conducts a visual evaluation of the seller's home, from the basement to the attic, on the inside and the outside. The inspector looks for problems that need immediate repair or may need repairs in the future, so it's important that you be there to ask questions. The most common problems are found in the electrical work, plumbing, the foundation, the roof, flooring, windows, the structure, and heating and cooling systems. The inspector will not report cosmetic defects, so check for these yourself, like scuffed floors or hideous wallpaper. What? The inspector will give you, the home buyer, a detailed report on any potential defects. Go over the report with your real estate agent and identify the repairs you think are most important. Do some research to find out how much these repairs may cost so you can address them with the seller. Negotiations can result in a few outcomes. The seller may offer to repair the issues, or you may have to fix them yourself, and sometimes the seller can offer a credit toward the price of the home for those repairs. Once all of the repairs have been mutually agreed upon, the home buying process moves forward toward closing. Why? Home inspections seem daunting at first, since it's the inspector's job to find flaws in your potential dream home. But rest assured that the inspector is working for you, the home buyer, to ensure three qualities about your new home. The safety, future livability, and the resale value. If you have any questions, ask your inspector and be there for the home inspection so you can feel confident that your new home is safe and sturdy for years to come. For more free home buying guides like this one, subscribe to our channel and check out nestiny.com.